Hi everyone, I just wanted to review Phrygian and Middle Eastern. This is in your module, so I wanted to just give you a video demonstration. That is Daisy. Okay, so here um, is the Phrygian scale E to E. kind of improvised there. All right, so um, you hear that what we have in Phrygian is this minor second between the E and the F. And then other than that, we have a natural minor scale. So, la 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 As with all the modes, we want to stay close to the tonic so we remember where we are. Um, and we want to emphasize the altered tone, which is this minor second. Okay, so if we want to move into Hijaz Kar, which is also sometimes called Middle Eastern, um, we have we start out with the Phrygian scale. But then instead of going to the G, we have one and a half steps. And we have a raised seventh. So those are the big difference. Although you can do a lowered seventh as well, it does work. But the biggest difference is this big jump. So sometimes it's nice to practice between the two. La, la, la. to end as opposed to a minor chord which would be um, what you would do for Phrygian. So make sure you can go spend some time in Phrygian. It's fun. You can play in other keys as well um, and make sure you can begin to go back and forth between Phrygian which will be the basis for Spanish which we're getting to um, and just car and play around with it make sure you sing with he just car the only last thing i'll say is that um melismatic singing is often um common so we don't have to always like sing exactly on the pitches right we can go between them e So you, because I don't know if it was really meant for piano, but um, but you can get kind of the idea if you sing in between the pitches and scoop between between the notes. Okay, so have fun with Phrygian and Hijaz Kar.